26,000 XP. Wow. Hi. Welcome to the New World Beginner's Guide. Today we're gonna see an easy way to make 60k XP. So in the first section, I'm gonna explain exactly how it works. And in the second section, you're gonna see me implement it. So you can see that literally anybody can do it. I understood two things. The first one, you get character XP not when you craft, but when you level up crafting. And second, cooking is by far the cheapest skill to level up. How does cooking work? First thing you can cook light ration, just requires skill level zero. As soon as you get level one, you can get travel ration. When you get level 50, light meal. When you get level 100, satisfying meal. And when you get level 150, hearthy meal. Light rations tier one, travel ration tier two, light meal tier three, satisfying meal tier four, and hearthy meal tier five. So beside the required level, to craft these, we're gonna need the proper tier of food. So if you want to craft a light ration, you can only use tier one and you see the little one in the corner there. To craft travel ration, where the first one on top is gonna need to be a tier two, but the second one can be anything. Light meal, tier three, second one can be anything, tier one, two, three, five. Satisfying meal, tier four. That's the bottleneck of the whole thing. You're gonna need a tier four ingredient to put first. There's really not that many affordable tier 4. There's pretty much only one, which is broccoli. Any meat, fish, other vegetable you can put there, they're pretty expensive. Broccoli is harvestable, and you can buy it for kind of a decent price. And tier 5, we're going to use pork belly, which is super affordable. And for the seasoning, we're going to use honey. Super cheap. So tier 5 is very easy to craft, and that's where the big XP is. And to cook up to tier five, you're gonna need a tier five cooking station like this one. Everything is super cheap to do beside tier four where you're gonna need broccoli on the first one. And uh, that's where it slows down a bit. Uh, you can harvest it or I would advise you put buy order and try to get it at a decent price. That video was made in one day, so I didn't have time to put buy order for most of the ingredient because I could have done it cheaper than I did. I'm gonna show you real quick how I buy these ingredients. Uh, I just think it's an efficient method. In the trading post, we're gonna click on resources, cooking ingredient. We're gonna go on meat, buy price, and then we have all the cheapest meat available on the market. As you can see, there's some super cheap fish fillet right here. In the vegetable, same thing. We can see that we can buy a ton of mushroom for super cheap. That's gonna be one of our secondary ingredient that we're gonna use, which we can buy dirt cheap, literally. Then if you go next page, can see cabbage really cheap at seven cents uh, squash too so there you have your three ingredient even if you were gonna cook tier five you have ingredient below eight cents and that's if you buy it outright uh, if you were to put buy order you could probably get it for half that price pork belly for tier five like i was saying 20 cents super cheap broccoli 54 cents from what i've seen it goes from 50 to 70 uh, if you put buy order, could probably get it for around 30. But this video was made in a day, so I didn't have time for buy order so much. So I pretty much purchased all the ingredients from sell order. But that's it. With six, 700 gold, you can buy everything you need to level up to max uh, cooking level 200. And by selling all the meal, you're going to make at least half to two thirds of that money back. For 60k XP, it's super cheap to do. I mainly did it under level 20. So there we go. In the second section, you're gonna see exactly how I've implemented that. And you're gonna see the result as it goes and how easy it is to do. Literally anybody can do it. So have fun. First thing you wanna do is pick a busy server. So we're gonna go with Eden. You can press escape, game menu, skip to new world. There we go. Okay, brand new character. I'm gonna do the little noob quest and I'll see you right after. We're done with the quest of the beach. I just spent 45 minutes to gather some herb. This is what we got. 655 Aesop, 32 cinnamon, 30 nutmeg. Now that we have access to the trading posts, we're gonna sell our Aesop. Why the Aesop is since patch 1.1, you need a new ingredient to craft a lot of potion, which is the Alcast, and you need Aesop to craft that Alcast. The price went up a lot, so that's why I gathered the herb. If we look at the nutmeg we got from gathering the herb, this sell for $2 each, 
the cinnamon sell for dolly 30. so this can sell while we're doing the basic quests because we need to get our faction anyway in 20 minutes i was able to get 400 isop 22 dill 12 nutmeg 13 cinnamon which is really really good nice there we go so that was 20 minutes for 180 gold that's really efficient we're almost at 350 coin thousand of xp level 51 now we can do light meal 168 light meal and that was nearly 4000 xp another 96 another 1500 once you're done with a beginner's fashion quest in your starting village you're gonna have mission that's gonna ask you to travel to the hermit shrine you're gonna be able to fast travel and the game gives you 200 as a to do it. So we're gonna grab all our food and we're gonna move to Windsward. So we're gonna fast travel there. The reason we wanna to go to Windsward is for the tier five kitchen. So we're gonna go over there, drop all our food and set her in there. And we're gonna place a buy order for broccoli. If we can buy some cheap, why not? All right, there we go, 139. 1200 XP, 191. That was almost 5000 XP. Uh, should be fine. Alright, 70. We should be good. Ooh, I made it 150. Uh, we're gonna go down. Good. Oh, let's go with that. All right, so let's see how much XP that's going to be. Twenty six thousand XP. Wow. So 100 of those 41 cents. Uh, that's forty dollars. So all 400 is one hundred and sixty. And that was about two hundred dollar invested. So you pretty much get your money back. Well, twenty eight dollar. Oh, that's the satisfying. That's not even a hearty meal. Eight dollar. And of course, I'm overweight. That was about a hundred and fifty bucks invested there. Let's see how much XP that gives. Nineteen thousand. Very nice. Yeah, and that's still worth a hundred and sixty. So I didn't lose any money. So there you go. Level 22, nearly 23. I'd say in total that was about 60, 70k XP for an investment of about six, 700 coin. And even that, you're gonna get pretty much half of it back selling the food. There's only the light meal that can be sold because it's worth one cent. But yeah, if you just do your quest, grab your coin, uh, do your daily faction quest, you're going to have more than enough money to uh, pull this off. See, we got another hearty meal uh, that just sold at 38 bucks. Well, 200 at 38 bucks. So you're getting your cash back and uh, you're making just a bunch of fixed out of nowhere. So that's it. Hope you've enjoyed this video. If you did, uh, like and subscribe and leave me a comment if you have any question. It'd be my pleasure to answer you. And I see you in the next one. Bye-bye.